All right, what is going on, everyone? Welcome to the Showcase Channel. Uh, we have here another uh, pack break that I'm actually very excited about. Um, I've had these packs for probably I don't know one to two days, maybe all just kind of sitting, and uh, I've been slacking on the videos for YouTube, and it's uh, I got my my wife, and my daughter asleep, so I've, uh, I've actually. <clears throat> got some time here. I should be streaming on Twitch right now, playing a game, uh, but I've already gone gone past like an hour past my usual startup time. Uh, I got caught up in something, so I'll just go ahead and make this video. That way I can at least get something on social media tonight. Um, so let's go ahead and get, get this out of the way. Um, it's going to be kind of a lengthy video because there's all different kinds of packs um, in this all different all three different sports and uh, don't know what what all is gonna be in here so um, alright uh, we've got some new stuff we've got everything you know if you if you watch my pack opening before there's always a nice mixture of stuff um, alright so we've got uh, <clears throat> we've got four packs of uh, 2017 uh, certified cuts of football. Four packs of that. Um, we've got four packs of this. I think this is from 2002. No, this is from <clears throat> this is uh, Upper Deck Vintage. I've got four hobby packs of this. This is from 2004. Uh, for baseball. All the rest of the stuff is going to be basketball. Um, I've got two packs of this. I know that y'all seen me break this stuff a lot on my channel before so all of my past videos but I've only got two packs of this um, this is a series one and this is hobby packs not the retail um, I've got two packs of this I know you've also seen me break some of this stuff before so uh, two hobby packs of uh, Fleer Ultra 9899 and then I've got three packs of this Upper Deck Choice, three packs of that, $98.99, those are also a hobby. I've um, got three packs of this, really nice set here, uh, three hobby packs of uh, 0708 Upper Deck. Um, this is the West version, so not the East version. I don't think that you can even get uh, Jordan cards from the West <coughs> version. <coughs> But we will see. I don't remember if you can or not, because I know that they have an East and a West. <clears throat> um, and then we've got finally the last uh, stuff here. We've got O uh, two O three um, Upper Deck Championship. Uh, it's Championship Drive. So O two O three. I've got three hobby packs of that. So there is a really big variety um, of stuff here so um, I don't even know where to start I'll just go ahead and go with this right here go with the 0203 championship drive I'll just do that um, I wanted to get this set because I saw that uh, of course the likelihood of getting anything Jordan is Unlikely, but I did see that you could pull a, uh, a then and now Jordan like jersey parallel. So I thought that, that was kind of cool. It did have a Bulls logo on there of him. Um, oh my gosh, my fingers are not working right now. I can't even get this open. Oh gosh, there we go. Um, got a then and then and now. Uh, Bulls with Wizards on there for Jordan so but uh, anyways we will see what we get so um, I'm trying to see I have no clue I've never opened this pack before never opened this product so here is the base card this is what the base card look like come on focus camera here we go alright that is what the base card looks like 0203 that is a Tim Duncan uh, base card. Pretty nice card. All right. Okay. 
Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Here is a rookie card. Uh, championship drive numbered out of 500. Mehmet Okur. I don't know how to say his name, so. Carl Malone and Brian Grant. Antoine Jameson. I didn't know Carl. Oh, that's for the Jazz. I thought I said the Heat for Carl Malone. Anyways, numbered out of 500, this uh, base rookie here. So I don't even know who that guy is. All right. Uh, let's keep it going with a upper deck choice. Uh, I'm going to be picking up a Beckett order um, in the next couple weeks, in case you're wondering, so be sure to stay tuned for that awesomeness. So, all these cards are stuck together. I know there's been some people say that, wow, you're really crazy for bending the cards, but it doesn't really do anything to the cards. Um, it just kind of separates them from each other, and it's actually better than just trying to actually get the card and peel it away. So, because if you get the card, if you get a retro pack like this, and you just, oh yeah, and you grab the edge and try to peel it away, you're going to mess up the surface. So at least if you're bending the cards, it doesn't really... You know, you can send a card into the graders that's bent, and whenever they put it in the grader, it's they're not going to deduct you because the card's bent or curved or whatever. So obviously if it has a crease in it, they will. But... Uh, Anyways, we've got, let's see what we've got here. All of these look like they're pretty pretty well stuck together, though, so there's nothing really you could do for that. Retro packs like that just kind of happens. Uh, got some flash stats. Team Olajuwon. Then we've got that draw your own game. Flash that to Kim Olajuwon, Chris Mullen. I had a really cool uh, Shaquille O'Neal card here. Grant Hill. And then, I don't know if y'all have seen this in a long, long time. Cool little uh, Jordan. Like They put this in like every pack, I think, back then. And then we got a Star Quest of Reggie Miller. Blue. So I think it goes. I think it goes blue, green, red, and then gold. Gold out of is numbered out of 100 though. I think it goes blue, green, and red. Blue, yeah, blue, green, red, yeah. Um, I'll go ahead and bust open another pack of this stuff. And on this stuff, the Star Quest is actually like right on the front of the packs, so which I didn't even remember. So I'm just gonna go actually from back to front. Kevin Garnett. Flash stats. Here's a flash stats. Keith Van Horn. Derek Anderson, Ray Allen, another Shaquille O'Neal, another Shaquille O'Neal, Jason Kidd, Allen Iverson, and Alonzo Mourning. So, some pretty nice ones so far. Pretty nice cards. Some nice veteran cards so far. Star Quest. A lot of morning. Pretty cool. Just another blue card, but still pretty nice. I gotta go through here because there's some upper deck choice reserve cards through here that you can find that are quite rare. 
All right, there are those. Let's go ahead and do a pack of the 0708. The 0708 West, this pack has uh, 15 cards in it, so they're really huge. Really, really thick packs. So, actually, better though for the people opening them or the people that are selling them, I guess, because you can't really tell what's in them. You can't really tell if it's a huge, thick card or not, but let's see what we've got. I think these ones will all actually slide cross pretty well so uh, looks like we've got some rookies here Delonte West uh, oh actually remember this set so yeah I think you can get Jordan from this set too so Devin Harris Eddie Jones ooh that's cool here is a nice looking card here it's a uh, it's electric court insert card Pretty cool. Monte Ellis, Electric Court. Pretty sweet card. Monte Ellis, Electric Court. Bobby Simmons, Joe Johnson, Ben Gordon, Dwayne Wade, Stephen Hunter. So those are all, I think, uh, just regular cards. So Dwayne Wade was probably the hit of that one. I mean, the uh, Monte Ellis, I mean. Okay, let me go with. Let's go ahead and switch it up. We've been doing some basketball stuff. Um, on the certified stuff, we've got like pretty, pretty much three thin packs and one thick pack on the certified. Uh, let's go ahead and bust open one of those. Four cards per pack. I have not opened this product. This is a really new product. There's actually not really like there's one obviously the the Mahomes rookie from this set, and then there's a couple other key rookies, but the Mahomes stuff is about the only thing that's really selling big from this set. So uh, any kind of anything from related to him would be good. Um, we've got Great Expectations and A.J. Green. Great Expectations of Miles Garrett, Miles Garrett, uh, non-numbered it looks like. A.J. Green, Matthew Stafford, Joey Bosa. Go to the second pack of this. Drew Brees, Des Bryant, Philip Rivers. So we almost had a whole quarterback pack there, except for the Des Bryant. Aaron Rodgers, uh, Canton Bound. Drew Brees, Des Bryant, Philip Rivers. Philip Rivers throws the football very odd. By the way, I must add that. All right, upper deck vintage. You can get. Uh, I looked up some stuff on here. You can get some really old school jersey cards uh, from this set. Uh, I think you can get obviously Lou Gehrig because he's on the front of the pack there. I think you can get a bat relic from Babe Ruth from this set. So there's a lot of vintage Yankee players, which is what I collect. I collect. I like vintage Yankee stuff. Chase Utley, Roy Holiday, Larry Walker, Carlos Delgado. So I don't know if any of these are rookies or not, but I guess we can check and see. No rookies on there. Some veteran players, but. Nothing, nothing at all. Uh, 
Everything's still good with the recording. All right. This is what the base cards look like. I'm so sorry that I did not show you, but uh, in case you have never seen this set, it's very plain. It's 2004 Upper Deck Vintage. Oh, this is cool. Hmm. Pretty cool insert there. Here is Sammy Sosa and Richie Sexton. So I guess they include these in there too as well. Uh, it looks uh, it's a play ball. I, don't, I think it's from the play ball set because they have a play ball, but I don't know. If, anyways, it's Randy Johnson uh, play ball. So I know sometimes that they will include like random cards sometimes and other from other sets in certain sets or something like that. If that makes sense, but. I don't know. Anyways, that's a pretty cool card. I like that card. Nice veteran player. Okay. Uh, we've got those two. This one. One pack of that left. Let's do a couple packs of those. We'll go to that one. Alright, this is 97-98. Uh, series one stadium club basketball. There was actually quite a few of these packs that came up for auction all at once, and unfortunately, I was not able to get as many as I would have liked to have gotten. Um, so I just picked up what I could, and then a lot of the times I would not be around whenever the auction would end. And so I was, uh, I would miss it. Um, all right, so now that you guys know what these look like, so I don't think I have to show them off, but they're still very beautiful cards. Michael Finley, Mookie Blaylock, Corey Alexander. <clears throat> Nothing in that one. All right, let's go with Fleer Ultra. This stuff is a single series, and you can get, of course, the ever so crazy <coughs> platinum medallion or the uh, the masterpiece insert. But uh, this set is a very collectible set because it's a single series, so everything is all packed into one. There's a nice uh, Mitch Richmond. For uh, my guy James Wong, who likes to collect this player, so uh, hit me up if you watch the video. If you you know still collect that that player, uh, Michael Finley, Alonzo Mourning. The only thing I didn't like about this set is I think the Jordan from this set is a horizontal card. If I'm not mistaken. Ooh, here's a uh, insert here. David Robinson. Oh, speaking of that, got a gold medallion here. Jeff Hornacek. Gary Payton. All right, let's check out the inserts here really quick. Uh, the gold medallion is going to be of Bobby Jackson. Gold medallion of Bobby Jackson. Pretty cool. And then the insert is going to be of <clears throat> David Robinson uh, MB, MB Attitude. MB Attitude, basically. That's how you say that. MB Attitude. Mm -hmm. David Robinson insert. Okay. Ooh, I hope everyone's had a good week. I believe tomorrow is Friday. Let me see what today is. Yes, tomorrow is Friday. So I don't think I'll be making any videos over the weekend, but you never know. All right, so we've got here. Sean Battier. Uh, we got 
filler card. Fozzie Wells and Allen Houston. So those are like all the worst players ever that you could get, except for maybe Brent Berry. Which he's kind of a veteran a little bit, but still <laughs> not very good. Um, let's do another certified cuts. I would like to get at least maybe a base rookie of one of the key rookies from this set at least. I'm going to send off a base rookie lot to Beckett here in the next uh, couple days or whatever. So, oh, there we go. That'd be nice to send off. I don't know if this is a rookie or not, but hmm, pretty cool. I'm not sure of uh, if any of these are rookies either, but let me see. Saints, Saints, Browns. Um, anyways, we've got to... Uh, I wish I could grade this one, though, but the corners are kind of messed up. But I'll probably sell it, though. I'm sure somebody will pick it up. Um, it's like a gold or platinum version of Allen Robert Robinson, a wide receiver. Uh, it's number three of ten. <clears throat> number three of ten. Uh, Allen Robinson, number three of ten. So I don't guess it's gonna focus, but oh, there you go. Yeah, number three of ten. Yeah. I don't know what. I guess it's the gold or, or platinum. If somebody knows what the set is, then you know, post in the chat. Um, but anyways, the corners, the top, the top corners are kind of messed up, but pretty cool looking card though. I mean. Just probably different text coloring and stuff like that, but number three of ten though is the best hit so far. All right, let's go ahead and open up another basketball. I don't really keep up with the Jaguars either, but I think he's a starter. Should be. Uh, I've heard of his name before, but all right, we've got this. Let's see. There's a Monte Ellis regular. Luther Head, Jason Kidd. Mecca Okafor, Tyshawn Prince. Maurice Williams. There's a nice Sekiel O'Neal, Chris Bosch. Ooh, Glenn Davis, big baby. Glenn Davis. Messed up corner on the back, though. I haven't heard his name in a while. I don't know if he even still plays or not. Alright, another vintage pack. Jermaine Dye. Bobby Abreu. Carlos Beltran. Ooh, what is this? A black and white. I don't know what the black and white means. I'll have to look up the black and white later. Or right now, maybe. <laughs> Just real quick. Just curious to see. Ball preview. Uh, let's see, play ball preview, black and white. Nope. Uh, regular black and white parallel, one out of every six. And the play ball preview, black and white, are... Uh, so the play ball preview is actually really good to get. The black and white parallel is one out of every 24. So this, this parallel is one out of every six, the black and white. Pretty cool. Raphael... Fukau for Furkle? I don't know. Okay, so I think we have, we are down to the fun part, uh, where it's one of every different pack that was in this break. So, um, I'm going to mix it up a little bit, and we will just go from there. We'll just go Collector's Choice, uh, Championship, 
little football. I think I'm going to end on vintage baseball. So let's do it like that. So I'm thankful. I am thankful and blessed enough that uh, I'm even able to do this for y'all. That I'm even able to budget a little bit per month. Um, I've been uh, going back and forth with my wife to slow down on, on getting cards because um, it is hectic on stressful at the end of the month whenever I get too much of it or whatever but um, you know I would be happy with even just doing this stack of cards but I appreciate everyone who views any of my videos um, but I'm like I said I'm fortunate enough that I get to do this obviously for myself but I like to uh, I really like to make and upload videos for you guys to watch too so um, Anyways, so enjoy the rest of it. Hopefully I can uh, find something and dust it off a little bit because, you know, I like to bust open the old school stuff. Actually, i got to make sure and open this one back to front again. So here we go. Randy Brown, Chicago Bulls. Ooh, there we go. Look at that. There is a nice choice reserve card. Pretty rare choice reserve. Terry Kittles, Glenn Robinson. The only thing that would make this better would be to get a Michael Jordan. Even the base Jordan would be cool. Let's see. Might have to dust this one off too. Mm -hmm. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. It's not MJ. I wonder if they'll discredit me for that right there. Kind of iffy if they discredit me or not for that, but the surface of the card. Hmm. Anyways, it's a pretty nice card. Kobe Bryant, Star Quest, blue. The front of the card is actually really nice. The back of the card has some surface peeling, so I don't know. It's not really that bad. Um, I don't know. I'll try to sleeve it up. It's actually a really nice card. I like it. So the front of the card is really nice. I've, like I said, I've been told that they grade the front of the card more heavily than the back of the card. Um, so um, I'm gonna go ahead and sleeve it up right now, actually. So because these cards are more, a lot more sensitive than <clears throat> than the newer cards. I don't have this card either, so. But, uh, yep, like I said, they're. Really nice looking card, though. Kobe Bryant Blue. And the Lakers, really cool card. Yeah, I'm going to send in some Kobe Bryant inserts later on down the road, actually, that I, I went through a bunch of cards and stuff and then oh here's the uh, if you're opening up this set so it's very easy to miss but it's uh, a bedazzled in the front this is <clears throat> this is called choice reserve uh, choice reserve and I, I might it may even be called UD choice reserve but I you can't really read the lettering uh, yeah, oh, it's Choice Reserve with a CR circled, and it even says the words Choice Reserve. But anyways, yeah, they're pretty rare to Choice Reserves. So I found out about this set. I actually have the Jordan version of this card, so stay tuned for that because I have that one that I'm going to send in for grading. Um, I've, just have, I've just had it sitting in my safe, so I haven't sent it in yet. So... Anyways, that one's a good card, too, to get. Choice Reserves are nice. I think I have one other one. 
um, that's non-Jordan related. That's uh, a choice reserve. Oh, pretty rare to get so those cards. Alright, if I can get this one open. Huh, not wanting to peel. There we go. So I think I like that Kobe a little bit better. But that numbered out of 10 uh, card is pretty nice, actually, too. So, Alright, Theo Ratliff, Jason Kidd, uh, Johnny Taylor, Keith Van Horn. Got two rookies back to back. Kendall Gill. Got another Corey Alexander. Nothing on those packs, golly. Alright, so nothing for the stadium clubs. Shoot. Got no big hits to show you guys though so far, so. This one's going to have a filler in it too. Gosh darn it. Alright. <clears throat> Rasheed Wallace. Jermaine O'Neal. Antonio Walker. Ray Allen. Man, I was hoping for at least a Jordan base out of that set. That's the only reason I got it. Well, never know until you open it. Alright. Maybe see if there's something in this one. I don't know if it's going to be a filler or not. I'm really hoping not, of course, but I'd like to be able to at least open something. I think it's a filler, though. Yeah, it's going to be a filler card. Marco Murray. Ooh, I wonder if it's an autograph. That'd be cool. Ooh, close. All right. Trevor Simon. Let's see. Uh, this is Heritage Collection. Uh, man, I wish this was numbered. Man, that's a bummer. Uh, Dan Marino. Heritage Collection. <clears throat> it's not numbered though, so it's just a you know base insert of him. All right, pretty cool card. Bummer. I thought that was gonna be a, a hit for sure. Um, all right. We've got the last pack of 2007 basketball. Marcus Aldridge. Is this a rookie card? It's a rookie card, isn't it? No, it's from 06, 07. Jason Richardson. Andrew Bynum. Kyle Lowry. Ooh, look at that. There is a uh, Supersonics. Uh... Kevin Durant, insert. Supersonics Basketball Heroes. Alright. Pretty much it right there. Let's see what this is. That was Supersonics, Kevin Durant. I'll set this one aside. I think I already have this card, but uh, like I think there's 10 cards out of the set, so I don't know. If there's that, a lot of cards out of the set, which I think there is, I'm, I usually don't get those kind of cards graded. But I'll set it aside, though. It's a cool card. It says, like, a rookie insert, I guess. All right, we've got the last basketball pack. The last two packs coming up. If you've made it in this far in the video, again, I thank you so much for the views. Be sure and subscribe. Uh, let's see, Alan Iverson. Oh, wow, that's nice. Cool looking uh, Jalen Rose card. John Wallace and Isaiah Ryder. I guess there's, I think there's a gold medallion 
every pack, but I'm not sure. But anyways, cool looking gold medallion, vertical card. Uh, Jalen Rose. Gold medallion. Alright, let's hope for some vintage players. That's the whole reason that I got this vintage stuff right here, because I was hoping for some for some retro players. But, I don't know, not a good pack opening for sure. I was itching to open all of it, but not working out in my favor. But hey, that's alright though. It happens. Jorge Posada. Um, we got a play ball insert. So all looks like like modern at the time inserts here. So, I mean, uh, players. Uh, Dontre Willis pitcher for the, uh, the Marlins, right? Yeah. Play ball insert. All right. But that'll pretty much do it. Um, I'll do a quick recap. I've got the play ball. I have the Durant. Uh, rookie insert. The upper deck choice. Randy Brown. The star quest. Kobe Bryant. Probably my favorite one. Favorite card of the break. <clears throat> the black and white. I have a feeling though that the value wise, this is probably going to fetch the most value, which may not even be that much, but it's number three out of ten of Allen Robertson. So we'll see. And then we've got the play ball of Randy Johnson. So that was my veteran player, basically, from that set. So. Anyways, that is uh yeah, that is pretty much it. I'm gonna turn these lights off, go through all this stuff here, throw away the packs, yada yada, and get ready for the work day tomorrow. So thanks for everyone for watching the video. Um, like I said, I will try to uh, upload a Beckett video. Um I still, like I, still, I still have to go pick the order up. I'm pretty sure it's ready. They have not called to confirm. But uh, if you guys like to see uh, a top 10 uh, of my cards that I have that are graded, then just let me know. Post in the comments. You know, if I even get like one or two, one or two or three people that comment on it, uh, you know, I'll probably just go ahead and do one. But uh, anyways. Yep, I'm out of here. Thanks for watching, and uh, I wish I could have pulled something cooler for you guys, but until next time, I will see you guys here on the Showcase channel. Peace.